This episode of Reaper Fish New Jersey will find Zach and I out on the inshore reefs. We initially target the blackfish, otherwise known as the hard fighting tog. We end up catching our limit, we sprint inshore, and right there on the three mile line, right off Brigantine, we finally find good striped bass action close to home. And then we ended the day with one of the most beautiful sunsets I had seen in a long time. Check out the video, guys. Here they go, the crazy SOBs, Reaper fishing. And there's frost on the deck. Yeah, I'm a flip. Wimp. I'll wait till Key West. I right, catch him up. All right, y'all, I think it's the 20th now, right? 20th. Going target. It's cold. It's probably 35 degrees right now. Water temp is even colder. 36 back here. So hopefully the tog too. Uh, apparently yesterday was a really hard current, so it's kind of tough. So uh, we'll see. Give it hell. As always, we bring tons of bait. Push on the half the weights in there. Now, invariably, when you do this, you know, winter fishing, I would say you, you kind of need a uniform, right? But by the time you get everything on the boat, you're sweating. <laughs> and then you want to get out in the cold. All right, y'all, we are on scene. Um, definitely a rough ride out. Well, wet ride out and a rough ride out. The wind's cranking out of the north. Uh, so we'll see, we're on big wreck in uh, 90 foot of water. Uh, hopefully the troll motor holds. Sometimes in these conditions it's tough. So, see how she does. Come on, baby. So what you can see there, you got prop speed of seven to 10. Uh, that normally ain't gonna cut it. A lot of times too, that'll drain your battery real quick. So. All right, y'all, pretty uh, extreme conditions today. Um, the troll motor is not gonna hold. It just keeps popping in and out of the water. It's every bit of four to five foot, uh, right on top of each other. Uh, so we're in a conventional anchor. We're starting to swing. Looking old. Looking good. And let's get to fishing here. So, uh, all of New Jersey's fishing community was excited about today. We've had wind for weeks on end, seemingly. Today was the first decent day. With winds forecasted at only, I don't know, seven to maybe 13 knots, I saw. And guys, it is nasty out here. It is uh, every bit of 20 plus. Three to four is right on top of each other. As of now, we're anchored okay. See, I don't know. You dog you. Oh yeah, dude. Guys, X put all the clinic up there. That's about enough out of you. Man, that's two for you. Alright, Christy's on the board. Look how great that one is. That's a tog, it's a good one. Shaking his head, right? There you go, Zachy. Kicking my butt, y'all. Kind of drifted a little to the west of where I want to be, but we're still getting bit. We're not getting doggy, so keep out of here for a while, I guess. Oh boy! I don't know what happened there. Zach. 
Crazy, crazy y'all. Crazy, literally nothing. Nothing on the screen. <laughs> See a little low lying stuff there to the right. Crazy, I've never seen such a blank screen. It's still caught Todd. There you go. Yeah, she blew out her guts anyway, right? They're all good. Good eating size. Huh? Oh, yeah. There you go. Get him, Zach. That's a good one. Come on, baby. Jump off that bottom. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice one. That's a nice one. Probably, not a 10. He's probably six, seven though, bud. Oh, man. Look how he swallowed it, dude. It's a good one there, bud. Yeah. Release them, you good? Oh, whatever you want, yeah. Your fish. You need meat? I don't need any meat. Get down there, big guy. I like it. So despite the strong northwest winds, I really wanted to get the drone up there and get you guys some neat aerial footage. I was a little bit rusty, but we went ahead and flew her anyway. Watch close here, you actually see Zach's rod getting bit right about there. Guys, this toggin, it, it takes a while to get used to. Um, there's definitely an art to it. Um, of all the fisheries I take part in, this one probably took me the longest time to master. There's a nice swing and a miss by Zach. Right about here, he gets his guy. Here that fly on over and let these gentlemen know that this here is my reef. This tog game, it's certainly not a sit with the rod and the rod holder kind of thing. You got to be at the rail holding that rod and attentive the entire time. If not, you're just going to sit there and catch dogfish and waste your time. my first time flying the drone on the little boat. I had a little trouble landing it. Zach is good at everything. He also flies RC planes and helicopters, so he gave me a hand. Oh, you know what? It's sitting the boat. It's sensing you, yeah. Try it back, okay. Right. Good job. <laughs> Oh yeah, I got a one. Female. Look at her. Beautiful. Nice female, y'all. We're gonna let her go though. Beautiful fish. Bye bye, baby. So yeah, we're well over our two-man limit now. Uh, we harvested eight, so I think from here on out, I'm only gonna keep one if it's a nice, you know, 15-inch male. Let all the females go. Anything big, let go. <laughs> This one, that's the one I'm looking for. I mean, y'all, it is just drop down, get bit. Well, let's go trophy hunting. Let's get some of these primo big white leggers on there. Pretty cool team is, uh, it's been one stop shopping all day, guys. We haven't left this wreck. Haven't needed to. Kind of rough anyway, so. Dude, that's like your eighth keeper. Good lord. It's called the Zach Show. Oh yeah, baby. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Yes. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm getting thumped too. Keep it her? That's a keeper for sure. That chunker, guys, he's so fat. We're gonna harvest this guy, it's a nice male, right around 15 and a half, 16. The size, again, we like to eat tons of meat on them. We let the girls and the big ones go, for the most part. Uh, so we harvested 10, we caught, I don't know how many keepers, quite a bit. Uh, probably talk fish another 20 minutes maybe, and then we'll sprint in and maybe catch a striper or two. It really is tough to leave when you have a good tog chew going. We ended up staying a little bit longer. It's just so darn fun. Yes. Another keeper. 
Guy Zach has just been the guy today. Only way to describe it. This is like his probably his 12th keeper, maybe. I don't even know what. Oh yeah, nice one, Zach. Nice female. Look how pretty she is. Pretty she is. Beautiful female. Look how pretty. Right, let her go. Good job, bud. We had stripers yesterday, me and Timmy. Trying to get one, maybe one or two stripers. Zach's girlfriend, Chris, wants some striper farm, so we can find some life inside there. So I just got a call that uh, they're right off here, right off Brigantine. Oh, they're boiled right here? Oh, there's bass right here. Oh my God, look at them. <laughs> we got birds, got some bass up top. Just got to get our opportunity here. Oh, there you go. Zach, right there. Off to the port, right off to the port, bud. Oh, you're running right through them. Oh, he spoiled right at it. There you go, you got him. Oh, dude. Oh my God, look at them all, dude. Yo, oh, right there at the boat. Oh, dude, he's good size too, bud. Oh, good size. You got one there? Yeah. Let me try that. Is they're actually under the boat pretty good now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, dude, he's got one hanging right with him. Oh, dude, look at him. Yeah, there's a big one right near him, though. Hold on. I haven't hooked up yet. There you go, bud. He had friends with him. Oh my God, it's got bit right here, dude. Oh my God, dude, they're right here. Oh my God. All right, guys, Zach's got one. He's playing it on his old school plug. Oh yeah, look at him, oh my God, look at him go. Oh my God, he's like in the wash. Oh, did you hear that? Wow. Do a little bait and switch there. Look at him go. Look at him hitting the... It's just fun watching him eat. Yeah. Come on. Come on to my plug. Come on to my plug. Come on to my plug. Come on to my plug like that. Kind of like that. Yes. Yeah, I got him. Came right on to my plug. Yeah, baby. Woohoo. Dude. Yes, that was awesome. It's like trolling for him. Yeah, fun. I know. Look at him, look, look, look. Look at the other one right there, look at him. Dude, there's three. Dude, drop, I'm telling you, hurry up. Drop the uh, bunker spoon down. I'll keep them right here, hurry up. Just toss it like right past it and let it sink. Yeah. They kind of left it, but yeah, and then let it drop. All right, ready while that's dropping. If you want, you can net this guy. All right, guys, we're gonna harvest one for Kristen. That's a good size. Ba boom. All right, guys, now you catch him. I'll do this. All right, guys, that was right behind the boat. That was really cool. Barely got him hooked too. Oh my god, that hook barely out, dude. Yeah, he's probably just a little small. Yeah, he's probably just a little small. No, -uh, did you? Yes. Oh, man, I'm real quick. Yeah. Got him. Oh my god, they're all under the boat, baby. Look. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, look, look. That's great. That's good stuff, man. Look, look. look. See what I say, you just gotta put it on a on a drift. They're they're under the boat. No clue what happened. Yeah, right? I just got bit. Oh yeah, kinda like that. Set that hook. I want to set that hook. There we go, baby. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you like that Who's he watcher, huh? Oh, this is fun. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, yeah, hold on. Hold on. Oh, 
Mine just popped off right there. Mine was the keeper. I know. I was trying to net it for you. Hold on. Watch that. Mine was the keeper, too. I should get bit right here. Pretty thick here. That one's close. You got him. That one's going to be close, bud. They're going good inside again. Look, see? <laughs> oh, man, that's a good one. <laughs> Dude, there's another one of these if you want. They seem to like this. All right, come on. One for Kristen. That's 28. Oh! <laughs> that's a good one. <laughs> there we go. There you go, Chris. Oh, dude, the screen's lit up. Zach, get down there. Good, I'll take care of him. Yeah, all right. There you go, Kristen. All right, Kristen, that's for you. I won't say I never did nothing for you. Guys, this one we're going to harvest. All right. Yeah, he's, oh, he's pretty pretty wounded anyway, so it works out. Stop it. Oh, he hit it right there. So fun. Oh, that's another nice one. Oh, dude, that's a hurry up. The net's free if you want it. If you want another one. Oh, wide open striper bite to end the day. Woohoo! What'd I say? Just put it on a drift oh, and jig. Okay. He might be he's alright? Okay, oh, he's fine. I didn't see it, Lord. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to keep two or no? Yeah. yeah? It's up to you, bud. I mean, we haven't kept, oh, yeah. we haven't kept many all year. All right, y'all, so nothing huge. That's a really good eating size. Um, again, I think this is number five and six I've harvested all season. So, again, I don't feel bad. Zach's girlfriend really wanted some striper parm. And these are happen to be what you call striped bass. So we're going to uh, harvest them. So bleed out both gills there. That was pretty cool, man. It's like it, it dings bottom, you come up and boom, they're there. Zachy hasn't striper fished with me in a while. Um, we keep saying on one of these tog trips, we'll find some bass on the way in. And we finally did, so pretty cool. They're hitting the flutter spoons and then, well, they're hitting anything. Zach just got one on a plug. I got one on a plug. Got one on a shad. So they're pretty, uh, they're eating pretty much anything. I guarantee if you would troll, you'd get all, all the fish you wanted, so. We'll see. What stinks is we got wind coming tonight, so these fish will probably be gone after Christmas, you know? Stop it. No, he's not, really? Oh my gosh, the Jesus, look at that. That's just neat watching that, dude. That's just cool watching that. Oh, yeah, look at him. He's right there. Oh my God, dude. They're all right here. Oh, I saw him eat it. See if he takes mine. Yeah, go ahead, bud. Look at them, guys. They're right here. That was so cool, Zach. Look at them. Oh, dude, I got a good one. Oh, my God, Zach. Look at this one. Oh, jeez. I think I got a good one finally. Ooh. <laughs> you said I'm going to drink one on a plug. Oh, my God, dude. I got a moose. Oh, my God, dude. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, dude. Come here, you big Oh dude, these are better ones in here. Probably drop right back down and get bit. That was cool. I saw him eat it. Yeah. This one I'm definitely gonna need in that. This is a big one, dude. Yeah, they're pretty all pretty good. Oh mine popped off. Let's see, bud. Pull him up. Good job, dude. Yeah, mine popped off right there. I wanted to see him, though. <laughs> Dropped it right down to the bottom, got bit. There's a little one. Dropped it right down and got bit. Dude, as soon as it hit the bottom. Yeah, I don't know why I pulled the hook on that big one. Probably pulled it, I had a lot of drag on him. I wanna get this guy off and get back out. Yes. Finally, finally off brigantine. Hold on, get him off. Stop it, stop it. Barely hooked, come on. Get off. Bye bye, baby. Let's get another one. Oh my God, as soon as it hit the bottom. <laughs> I'll tell you what though, the one that pulled the hook was big. 
he must have been lagging behind the, the school here. These are all the same size. Oh my God, dude, they're just swarming after him. That is so fun. Come here, handsome. Also, too, if you want, you drop down that Ava jig, bud. They're kind of keyed into the bottom now. Good. Easy release. Oh, I got this. I got one. <laughs> it's so fun. Oh, oh, oh. Zachy with the light tackle. And what we'll do is we'll make a wiggle back up there where them birds are. I stopped marking them. They're moving quick. Oh, that'll Oh, that'll work though. I tell you what's crazy with this with this spoon, you really gotta stay tight on them. Look at you. Look at you. Come here. Anywhere. Come here, baby. Alright y'all. Beautiful. Beautiful. Schooly New Jersey striper. Back there, baby. And they're under the boat now. I'm trying to get you on on the top water stuff. There you go. All around the boat, bud. All around the boat. Laura, there they are, right there. It's a great fishing platform. y'all beautiful striper let them go all right let's see if we get another one that's kind of like that oh pull the hook oh i just bit it again it's weird though the school they're not like giant schools you got to kind of move sorry i'm being selfish let's see bud oh yeah ready yeah yeah that's a chunker Oh, it's a chubby one. He's probably got yeah. some bunker in there, boy. Hey, get off my thumb, sir. This is fun. This is fun. I have to uh, go 40 miles. Oh, I'm in too. Boy, I wasn't even marking a ton, really. Oh, yeah, they're under the bit. Oh, my God, mine's got him. He's just like, <laughs> mine's got another one right with him, like, trying to bite his tail. Got him? All right, y'all, look at the fat belly on that one, dude. Look at the fat belly. I know there's some adult bunker in there. Yeah, that's a beautiful. That's fat. All right, get him in. All right, baby. One last one, y'all. I was just about to call it a day. The screen lit up. We had the drone up a second ago. Of course, we didn't get one then, but yeah. Once we got our pattern down. They really just want these flutter spoons on the bottom. What's really neat too, I'm just getting them on one hook, so they're not really hooked bad. Get them all unhooked very quickly. Back into the bottom, they're all healthy. <laughs> Alright y'all, one last outro I think. Um, what a stellar day, that was just unbelievable. Just Zachy and I, two man tog limit and then some. It was started off nasty, I didn't even think we were going to be able to fish. I said let's just try and get anchored and we did. We repositioned about three times, I think, on the same wreck. We never left that wreck one-stop shopping. Um, what's really neat being a local and, and having the network I have, guys were hitting me up and saying, yo, Chris, there's striper. So on our way in, we stopped and boom, caught a bunch of bass. So that's really cool. Those are Zach's first stripers in a while, right, bud? Yeah. Yeah, in a couple of years, yeah. So anyway, you can see that uh, sunset behind me. I say all the time, I mean, I love this time of year. It is getting cold, but I still love this time of year. It's beautiful. As always, I'll see y'all on the next video. Super pumped. We're, we're getting distracted. We'll see them under the boat again. But we're going to get out of here so we don't have to run home in the dark. So, super pumped.